we are in such a serious situation you know we're not serious people honestly we're not serious people nigerians in in the abroad are not going to come to nigeria and come and fight if the people there are unable because of the military because of what have you it's just going to have to be what is going to be is going to be you know and for those people who think there's going to be a se separation go on youtube and google chechnya in 1991 and see what putin did to the chechnyans when they wanted to separate from russia i have said this many times if the state of california or the states of texas decide to take up arms against the United States, they will finish every single citizen in that in that in those states. They are not going to let you go. You will only be able to go if you fight. And I don't know if the people are ready for a second Biafra. But from the economic, I look at the numbers. We don't have an economy that can support two hundred thousand paying people two hundred thousand. We just don't. All these foolish people, a few years ago, they were celebrating Nigeria is the number one economy in Africa. I said they are lying to you. Don't lie to yourself. You are not. What are you producing that makes you number one economy? We need a bunch of people that can be brought together to really, really do a breakdown of where we are how we got here and where we aspire to be we're going to be 400 million people by 2050. we keep buying foreign cars because yeah because they want to put together and nigeria will break down in four years whereas this same fools buy another set of covering cars every four years if somebody went down the allowances that this People that if their morning says it to be good, their evening will never make it good for them and their generation. Because anybody that does this to people, no matter how much money they have, they will still be poor. We are in deep trouble. All the talking we do here every week is good, but I don't think that somebody that has six children with guanchoco and their stomach is big like this needs anybody in uk or america to come and tell him he's in trouble a lot of the people i talk to in nigeria they have two phones they know the they know the price of things in america and uk than me that i'm in america it's a matter of your what's important to you priority me i will continue to come i will listen i will do the best that i can do with the nigerians that i do things with in nigeria but we're not going to solve this this is a big big problem they talk about they spend so many so so much money i remember maybe it was 16 years ago people in in the which, whichever the houses over there in nigeria they said they would they're buying trash cans from uk because the one they make in Nigeria is not good enough. If you don't support the one that they make in Nigeria, you're, you're, you're providing jobs in UK. Yeah, you don't need to go to school. You don't need to go to school to understand that. Mama boss said that sells, that sells um, tomato can tell you that. These, are, these people, they know what they're doing. These are just evil people. These are just evil people. So my brothers and sisters, I will continue to come here. We're not gonna solve this on the service issue. We can create all the media houses we want and educate people and enlighten people what we want until the people are willing to fight. Okay. We're going nowhere. Thank you very much.